All right. Another reading for my collective. What are they not want? What are they not telling you? What are they not sharing with you right now? Those who are dealing with a significant other at this time, what are they not sharing with you at this time that needs your attention? What do you need to discern? And what do you need to be showing your attention to words? What is it that you need to be paying attention to? What is spirit wanting you to see based upon this connection that you're currently residing in? Spirit wants you to know that wherever you're currently residing in right now, you need to get creative. You're going to need to get creative with this situation and collect a lot more information pertaining to this connection because whatever's going on behind closed doors in this connection is pertaining to another masculine energy. I could be talking to a feminine you could be dealing with a masculine energy that might be attracted to somebody of the same sex. Somebody is doing moon magic. This is dark energy. Somebody's feeling tempted right now. You're collecting information right now, collective on this whole situation, because you're sensing from a higher power, and and this moon, this new moon, might have triggered this entire this entire situation to unfold and and explode for you. You could be dealing with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Also, do keep in mind in what your placements are in regards to where your Saturn is. What are the placements for your Saturn in regards to your limitations and your practicalities at this time, collective? What is your partner or your other half, the person that you clicked on this reading for? What are they hiding? What are they not sharing with you that you need to be aware of at this time, collective? One more card or one more shuffle. Somebody needs to surrender to change. Surrender to this transformation. Surrender to the fact that transformation is not pretty. It is ugly. And there's nothing pretty about transformation except for when you transform. Clear the energy, please, Spirit. Thank you. Somebody's got high anxiety right now. Yes, there is a need to surrender to this. Surrender to the changes. Nothing comes without hard work or sacrifice. Somebody needs to use their discernment on a situation. Self-fulfilling prophecies. I just heard somebody's getting their manifestations in. Check your Neptune energy. Where are you spiritually and what is it that you are thinking about? What are you calling in? What kind of energies are you attracting into your life? Spirit wants you to know that the current energy that you're residing in, you're closing out some cycles pertaining to generational lineage. There might need to be if there might need to be some forgiveness pertaining to a mother or father figure. This could be your mother or your father or this could be pertaining to the mother or father pertaining to your children. You could have children with this individual. This is your significant other. And your significant other is in the is in their mind right now in regards to a connection could be related to a mother figure. They feel blocked and stuck in regards to this mother figure. They want to honor this connection with this mother figure. There could be things going on behind closed doors with this mother figure. Venus, Uranus energy. Check your Venus. What is their peace and harmony? Somebody does not feel like they have any peace and harmony with their mother. You have the will to create your own your own world, your own realities. This is the self-mastery, and that is in your challenging position. So you feel like you are stuck and stagnant, like you can't move. I'm picking up some dark energies here. Some Somebody could potentially be blocking communication. They could potentially be just blocking their own emotions from stepping forward into this. They could also be blocking their own abundance based upon being in their head in regards to this mother figure that is in the way I just heard they are in the way. Somebody needs to stop the pattern. Somebody is repeating old patterns. You have the will to harness and create control. Mercury energy, think and speak with mindfulness. Okay, so self-mastery. So this is a manifestation. Somebody's manifestations have not been coming through because they've been holding on to this mother figure. Somebody could also be holding on to a father figure. They could, there might be a need to forgive a mother or a father figure in, regard, in, in order to be able to have this manifestation come through to fruition. The action needing to be taken. You need to count your losses and speak your authentic truth, okay? 
This is emotional energy. I could be dealing, or you could be talking, I could be talking to a Pisces, or this could just be one of those things where you feel like a little fish in a big pond, where you don't have that whole lot of confidence, hence the reason why your manifestations aren't coming in. You need to forgive yourself. I feel like I could be talking to a mother figure. You could be the mother of the household. You could, you could have children. There is a need for you to not be so hard on yourself. Forgive yourself for this situation, okay? You need to learn to love yourself and stop these patterns, these mind patterns that you have yourself in. They're pertaining to mental. This is mental blocks, okay? So your mental blocks are preventing your manifestations from coming through. And Spirit wants you to let go and release that and start speaking authentically and be authentic within your emotions. Follow what your heart is telling you. There is, an, a, there is a disruption taking place in your household at this time. You are grieving over the loss of something. There's a disturbance in life, not able to move forward and closure issues. So somebody could be having closure issues in regards to a mother or father figure. There could be closure issues in regards to something that they've been trying trying to manifest in and they haven't been able to manifest because there are closure issues pertaining to what they are manifesting. There is a need to open the doors and see things from a different perspective. Shift your perspective. I could be talking to a Pisces. Walk away, choose you this time, start fresh and adapt to change. Allow your intuition to lead the way. Pisces energy, I feel like this is you and you're ready to walk through the door into the unknown and you're ready to cut your losses and pertaining to what this manifestation was. Whatever this star manifestation was, I feel like what happened here is that it wasn't what you expected it to be or you manifested something and you didn't realize what you were wishing for. You know, you need to be careful with what you wish for because it might just come in. All I know is at the end of the day, spirit is saying that this connection, whatever is going on in this connection, somebody's harboring secrets and they're not speaking authentically. They're not being authentic in this. I feel almost an un unrequited love situation here. And if I am talking to a Pisces, it is time for you to walk away.